I'll tell you what's going on, and I'll tell you what, it's happened right now. Light rain across the city today. Again, we're not necessarily talking about big time rain amounts here today, but it's been steady. It's been pretty good. And what we saw here is we expected to get some rain up around the four corners, but we've definitely seen more of it here. And most of the dynamics shifted down just a little bit. So central sections of New Mexico got the showers here while farther up to the north, a little less action. But now we're starting to see action across areas like the Jemez Mountains and into the Sangre de Cristos tonight. I think we'll get some snow showers here, but things are actually going to back off at least for the next four or five hours or so and then into tomorrow things really get ramped up once again. So winter storm watches northeastern New Mexico all the way through the northern mountains and then winter storm watches continue for Durango, Pagosa Springs and winter storm warnings for the San Juans. These areas, I think, especially mountain areas above NASA 8500, 9000 feet, a foot of snow, I think will be a real possibility. 45 degrees in the metro. And by the way, that's with round one of this, not the whole deal. 45 right now. Winds are not a big factor at this point. Snow levels hanging around 8000 feet at the current time. But again, what's going to happen is a lot of this shower activity is going to work its way out and temps will continue to drop 40s and 50s to the north down to the south 50s, 60s and low 70s. Again, we've got the jet helping out here. A little weather disturbance mixed in sliding through the area. And what's going to happen is this is the last little disturbance right here that kicks through things quiet down and then we get ready for a big time Arctic front, which is sitting off to our northeast. So here is your storm report. Got a few different things happening now. Storm is forming off the California coast. We might as well go now through Monday is the time frame on these couple of weather makers. Metro wind looks like a real possibility late tomorrow. Cold temps, snow is possible too. Heavy mountain snow is a likelihood. Ice out to the east and very cold temperatures. Bus potential continues to drop 30% and falling. Here's a look at what we expect. Cold front comes in throughout the day tomorrow. As it does, we'll start seeing snow in the northeast, some icing in the lower elevations, and snow in the northern mountains. Here in the metro, we're going to crank up the winds. Scattered showers during the day tomorrow, but winds tomorrow night could well create that little snow hole here in the city. But look at what's going on around us. Ice to the east, snow in the north, and snow and rain mixes out to the west in through Friday here. If we're going to get really aced out of things here in the metro, it will be because those gusty east winds end up pushing the precip out of here. If we keep the winds down a little bit, we've got a shot at some precip and maybe a little bit of snow or ice mixes here in the metro. And here's a look at how it all shakes out during the day tomorrow. You'll start to see it expand scattered showers west and snow and rain mixes over to some ice across the east. Snow fills in over the northern mountains during the day into early on Friday morning. I think Friday could be a mess in the East Mountains where we could start to really crank up the snow amounts there as well and into the metro gusty winds and that mix of a little bit of west side snow will be a possibility as well. And then into Friday night, things will start to taper a shade. But then remember, We've got the core of the main storm coming in over the weekend, and you'll see that reflected in the seven day forecast. Temperatures in the 40s across southern Colorado, mostly cloudy, wet mix over to some snow. Northwest, mostly cloudy, showers out there tomorrow, and mixing into snow Friday into Saturday as well. Across the southwest, chance of showers here with mostly cloudy skies. Better chance at picking up rain and snow Friday and Saturday. Over to the southeast, this is the number of the day 76 tomorrow for a high, Friday. High 32 with a shot at some snow and ice. We are looking at the possibility of ice tomorrow night and throughout the day on Friday across the northeast with temperatures plummeting and staying low through the weekend with showers. 30s for the most part in the high mountain communities tomorrow with snow setting in and then accumulating snow Thursday night and Friday with more on the way this weekend. East mountains mostly cloudy scattered showers early. What's going to be interesting is a shift over to snow, which I think is possible tomorrow night. Watch out in the East Mountains, I think, for Friday morning. Temperatures 50s and 60s in the metro for tomorrow. Mostly cloudy. We'll have some showers around. And then the gusty east winds come ripping through late tomorrow night and Friday. You guys, that could push any precip out to the west side.